happening, folks? Gerald here, aka JFro90, coming at you with another reaction, bringing another special artist to the channel who I'm hoping to see a lot more of. Um, this is Taylor Dane with I Will Always Love You live at the Apollo in, I believe, 1987, 88. Um, this is important because she's another blue eyed soul queen who, who who i grew up on and like i said there were three in particular taylor dane lisa stansfield and tina marie where i i i would have bet hard money that they were black women based off of just hearing their voices like i said that's the importance of me doing reactions is there's a lot of singers who um performance wise and video wise i'm not familiar with too much but i know the songs and i know their voices from the radio and now thanks to the internet i know like pictures and the album art and all that kind of stuff but i still you know uh haven't seen many performances i chose this one for a few reasons first off let me say love will lead you back is not only my favorite taylor dane song it's one of my favorite songs ever <laughs> you know um but I decided I wanted to go with something different. So I've heard from people who are bigger Taylor Dane fans than me. Like, I'm not that familiar with her discography like I'd like to be. But I know from people who are uh, really big fans, really familiar, they have a strong love of her song, I Will Always Love You. And um, I know it. I like it, but it's never quite stuck, the recorded version. I've seen the music video before, too. I've, se I've seen a good number of her music videos not all of them but a good handful so like i said with this song with the recorded i will always love you and the music video for it the song never left a huge dent for me like it never i never got that one of the favorites <laughs> you know that it is for a lot of people and so i want to hear a live rendition of it at the time too especially and i want to i want to hear how that does for me you know so Excited to check it out. This is her at the Apollo. I'm, you know, y'all know I love me and the Apollo. It's, for me, it's the Apollo and it's solid gold performances. Like th those are the ones I'm the most excited about. So excited to get to it. But before we do, need you guys to go ahead and subscribe, ring the bell for notifications. Um, and yeah, like again, I'm I'm excited to see this. And what I'm really excited for is I spoke of in the video I just did. Uh, Lisa Stansfield been around the world where. What I love about Apollo performances is that it's a very mutual energy of when the audience knows you and is rooting for you, it does something to that stage, to the performers on that stage, and then that does something to the performance they gives, and it's this, it's this energy, so I'm really curious to see how Taylor's performance is going to translate with that. So, without further ado, this is Taylor Dane with I Will Always Love You, live at the Apollo. technique like she gives so much and then you pull it right there. Mm, love that love that i'm gonna rewind that part just a little bit admiring that technique You have made my life 
I might have liked that one more than the like recorded one. I th I might have to go back during the course of editing this and actually listen to the recorded one again because it's been a minute. But I really I loved everything she was doing with that performance. She sounded great and she sounded. I really just love um her technique, her technique, and she's got a natural. She, every it's everyone knows she got natural soul but it's the technique she uses with it too fantastic and just really enjoyed that i will say the audience seemed more tame than i'm used to for the apollo performances <laughs> but that was great she probably that was probably the second performance after she already killed it with uh tell it to my heart so um really enjoyed that so more taylor dane reaction i mean recommendations in the comments there i'm not going to necessarily go in an order in terms of reacting to her because there's already a tense of familiarity there so um what sticks out is gonna really i'm gonna go my own way with it but um let me know your favorite taylor dane song too in that and like i said my favorite for sure is love will lead you back but a close second would be um i'll wait I'll wait. Yeah, funny story about I'll wait, and I'm definitely going to do, because I might do another reaction. I might do a reaction to the video for that, because though I've seen it before, it's been a very long time. It's been over 10 years for that. But um, I know of it as the Blank Check song, because it is the theme for the movie Blank Check. But um, when I saw that movie as a kid, and I heard that song, I loved the song at first listen. I thought it was Patti LaBelle. And... Before, don't come down. If you got something to say. But I, I was like six or seven. I didn't know Patty that well in that time either. So, But their voices lended themselves to similar highs and similar sounds and dictions and stuff. So to me, that's, that'll always be funny for me. And that'll always be a thing of I always heard her as a Patty LaBelle. 
<laughs> so anyway, love me some Taylor and um, excited to get to know more of her discography. And I hope you enjoyed this reaction. If you did, please go ahead and like, subscribe, ring the bell for notifications. Let's go for this channel with 10,000 subscribers. We're going to get there, but I'm going to need your help to do it. And um, if, please feel free to share this video on social media with your friends and people who would dig my ever-changing crazy hair. <laughs> That's why I also appreciate Taylor. Taylor has ever-changing fantastic hair as well. <laughs> and if you would like to tip or donate or sponsor a request, that's in the description below. Or if this video is lucky, it might have the heart thing and that'll help with that. I encourage you to always tip your creators that you are subscribed to, that you enjoy, because that goes a long way. And this is not easy. <laughs> so, um, you can also join my Patreon. You can become a patron on the Patreon. And on there, you're going to get things like early access to videos like these and Patreon only videos like these. And now I just want to give a special shout out to each and every one of you who pressed play on this video. I appreciate you all and beyond everything else. Please take care of yourself and each other. I can feel this